We start this morning with tough news for the Fulton community. 16-year-old Brady Niver has died from injuries he suffered in the same crash that killed his 17-year-old girlfriend, Riley Bartlett. It's the news none of us want to wake up to. Since the crash just over a week ago, the Fulton community had been praying for Brady to pull through. News Channel Line's Adrian Smith is live from Upstate University Hospital this morning where Brady put up a strong fight. Good morning, Adrian. Good morning, Nicole and Ryan. He certainly did. And as we know, the central New York community has been rallying and praying and hoping that Brady Niver would make a full recovery. But sadly, he did pass away here at Upstate Hospital eight days after the tragic crash in the town of Granby. Fulton Superintendent Brian Polvino did confirm his passing in a district wide letter sent to the families last night. Brady's longtime girlfriend, 17 year old Riley Bartlett, also a junior at G. Ray. Bodley High School died at the scene of the crash on Sunday, April 30th. Her calling hours and funeral were held over the weekend. The two other victims in this crash are Fred and Sharon Strickland, a couple in their 70s. They both also sustaining serious injuries in the crash and are continuing to recover here at Upstate Hospital this morning to help the students and the staff members in the Fulton City School District. The crisis response team at the district will be made available at the high school today to again help the parent, help everyone cope with this tragedy and superintendent Polvino writing in that letter encouraging everyone to get help. He says in part quote, please do not hesitate to reach out if any student, staff or community member needs individual support as we grieve this tremendous loss. We appreciate your ongoing kindness and support. We extend our deepest condolences to the families, loved ones and friends of all involved. And it's just certainly a devastating situation all around. And News Channel 9 is continuing to send our support, prayers and love to the Fulton City School District at this time. Live in Syracuse, Adrian Smith, News Channel 9. Okay, thank you, Adrian. Such a tough update.